everyone needs hope. Everyone needs to know what life is all about. That they are loved and accepted. Whether you're a rapper on the street corner, homeless, jobless, sick, or just an ordinary waiter doing his job. Our small group went to Nashville. We fellowshiped and shared and the lights and the sounds captivating. It was easy to get distracted. It was easy to lose focus. We all had our own plans, things we wanted to see, things we wanted to do. Were there some missed opportunities? Sure. But God got a hold of us. God got a hold of me. Strengthen the feeble hands, steady the knees that give way. Then the eyes of the blind will be opened, and the ears of the deaf unstopped, and the mute tongues shout for joy. So we went to the streets, right there in Nashville. We prayed for people. We went to a small honky-tonk bar, and that's where God decided to show up. That's where God decided to make himself known to a waiter. Sarah asked us what God's heart was for him. Sarah said she thought he might be an artist. Katie got even more specific and said that she felt that he might be a tattoo artist. So we sat and we listened to the music and waited for that opportunity. And it never came. So I walked up to him. I said, hey, do you like to draw? And he said, yeah, I, I do. I was like, you're an artist? He said, I'm a tattoo artist. So Sarah came over and she told him, when we came into this place, me and my friends prayed for you. We asked God to reveal something about you that, that we don't know. He told me you love to draw. And he told Katie that you were a tattoo artist. Sarah then told him the reason God told us about you is because he wants you to know that he knows every detail of your life. And he loves you like crazy. His face said it all. He was amazed, confused, dumbfounded. He was in reverence that the creator of the universe had sent people to his bar just to tell him, I know you. love me. We just left him with a hug and a blessing. And when that happens, your understanding of God's love for you and others grows so deeply. You just reach out more and more. So once again, everyone needs to know it, what life's all about. They're loved and accepted. Whether you're a rapper on the street corner, homeless, jobless, sick, or just an ordinary waiter, at a bar in Nashville.